Good morning and welcome to lesson five of our English unit, expressing preference for a character. Today our learning intention is we're going to be examining an alternative representation of a character. So from a similar story, but our character is going to have a little bit of a twist. The success criteria is we're going to discuss the character of Cinders and we're going to share opinions about Cinders. The resources required is you'll need to download your Cinders the Rockstar Gang and that book is available on your OneNote. So in the previous lesson, we read a traditional retelling of the fairy tale, Cinderella. In this lesson, we will read a story with the fairy tale characters, but these characters are not quite what you expect. Before we start, we're going to activate some prior knowledge from the original story of Cinderella. Firstly, with your learning buddy, I'd like you to think about the character of Cinderella from the previous lesson. What are some of the qualities of a traditional fairy tale princess? If you need to, you can refer back to your learning war. Second question, what are some of the qualities of a traditional fairy tale stepmother or stepsisters? That's right, they were cruel, mean and ugly. Question three and our last question before we start our reading is what happens to Cinderella at the end of the story? Again, you might like to refer back to your retail from the Cinderella Learning War. So, now I'm going to ask you to read through Cinder's the ebook, The Rockstar Gang, with your learning buddy. Alternatively, you can watch the video of Miss Edwards reading this book. I'll pause here while you read. Now that you've finished reading Cinder's The Rockstar Gang, we're going to ask a few questions before we start to form our opinion. Our first question, which I'd like you to share with your learning buddy, is The images of Cinder's at the beginning of the story show her like a rock star with black hair and skull and crossbone clothes. Do the words that describe Cinder's actions match the pictures? Open the page to that picture and discuss with your learning buddy. Our second question. The image of Cinders with the lemon head in the story shows her as a scary and mean. Do the words that describe Cinders' actions match the pictures? Again, have a reread and share with your learning buddy. Finally, share with your learning buddy your opinion about which character or story you prefer. See you all tomorrow.